Well, hey there, everybody. How y'all doing? I hope everybody's having a wonderful day or night. Welcome back to my channel. As always, I'm Deluxe. All right, let's do another freaking Transformer review because I love some freaking Transformers. Today, we'll be taking a look at Studio Series Concept Art Decepticon Rumble Frenzy, whichever one you want to call them. It doesn't matter. Well, I guess it does matter, but however you want to call them, they call him Rumble. So there you go. There's the box. Looks good. Love the artwork. As always, looks really good. Love that. On the side, he is core class, if you didn't know by now, it's a small little fella. And on the back, you got a nice little couple of pictures, and that's pretty cool. All right, now on this side, very nice artwork as always. All right, let's just jump right into it, and let's find out what, uh, let's find out some stuff about Decepticon Rumble from the Bumblebee movie. All right, here he is. Here is Rumble in his 5-2 Toys cube mode. Um, yeah, something, you know. Uh, the weapons can store in there, which I'll show you that a little later. Very cool. You got the little, you know, pile drivers and everything. Got the, you know, little paint right there, a little blue, yellow. We'll see some gunmetal silver. We'll see more of that in bot mode. Got a little yellow in the crotch area. So not, not you know, not much to him. Um, unfortunately, I do not have my sound wave, but there are tons of videos out there. Uh, he does fit in his chest, and that's awesome. I like that they did that. And um, but yeah, I don't have sound wave, and I don't have Ravage out, unfortunately, to do comparisons. So yeah, there you go. There he is in his uh, cube mode, or you know, um, you know, five two toys kind of mode right there. But you know, it's pretty cool that the uh, they included the you know the uh, weapons to be stored in there. So that's really nice. I like that. So there you go. That is Rumble in his uh, cube mode, tape mode, whatever you want to call it. It's a cube. And there is Wheelie, Magic Square Prowl. You got uh, Prime from New Age. You got Red Alert, and then you got some uh, Dustbuster Jazz, and that's scale. All right, I'm going to go over transformation real quickly. These are real easy, you know, so don't have to do the music montage thing or not montage. But anyways, uh, take this, swing out. That's his arms. Then you're going to untie these, and then you're going to, you can take the weapons out. You get two weapons, which I'll show you those real quickly. You get one little gun, nice, uh, just, you know, nice sculpt work, but uh, just, your, you know, gray plastic. And another little pistol and everything. Once again, a little sculpt work in there. Not too bad. All right, moving on. And you got to move these down like that. You're going to flip out his feet right there. Then you're going to flip out his head. Or uh, actually, I'm sorry, you're going to do the little, little ab crunch. And then you're going to turn the head around. And then move these down like that. And you're going to tap those in. And then do the same thing. And then tab those in. All right, there you go. That is Rumble Transform. Oh, you can put the uh, guns on the back of them. So tab those in right there. Doesn't matter which one, whichever side you want or which one you want in, in whole. Giggity. Uh, you can put them however you want to. So pretty cool. All right. So let me, uh, I'll be right back. I'm going to all situate and uh, we'll talk about some Rumble. All right. So here he is. Nice little head scope. Got the nice red visor. Looks really good. As far as articulation, um, side to side, you go all the way. It's a little tight. It's on a ball peg. Uh, you can look up a little bit. That's pretty cool. No, uh, not much down. The little collar, the little blue collar gets in the way. But nicely it's painted. You know, nice light blue right here. And on the orange right here, you get a yellow. You get some red, some gunmetal silver, some more yellow. A little red right there. And then a little yellow on the, you know, footsies and everything. So pretty cool. Nicely painted. I like that. Core Class usually does a great job with the, the paint. They put a, some decent paint on there and everything. All right, as far as the arms, now, he doesn't have any hands. <laughs> he just uses the pile driver. 
Um, so I wish they would have gave him some hands because he can't really hold these. I think I've seen where the uh, sound wave can actually hold the guns if you want to use them uh, for that. But that's pretty cool. But I kind of wish they would have gave him some hands. But uh, I like the sculpt work on the, um, you know, the pile drivers. And I love that they put the Decepticon symbol. It is upside down, but I love that they put the Decepticon symbol right there. That is nicely done. Really cool. I like that. So as far as articulation with these, uh, you do got like an up and down motion just for transformation um, all the way around. And that's about it. Uh, you do have this and you can break this right here and then do this like that and kind of look like he's, you know, whatever. Uh, so not much there, but that's about it for that. Uh, no waist swivel. I think they could have given him waist swivel, but they did give him an ab crunch just so he can do the pile drive thing. That's pretty cool. And a back crunch too. <clears throat> so that's neato. Neato potato. All right. Van Dam all day, every day. That is nice. And you got the kick up and kick back. No thigh swivel. You do got a knee bend with the uh, ball peg so you can swivel. So I guess that takes over, you know, for the uh, uh, thigh swivel. You do got a swivel of the knee. So that's pretty cool. And you got a toe tilt up and that's it. As far as that, no rock or anything like that. That's cool. In the back, you know, it's okay. Not any I think waffles. I guess a little back right there, but they do got some scope work in there, so that's pretty cool. I like that. So not bad, not bad at all. But I do like the scope work on the pile drivers. That's pretty cool. So that there you go. That is Rumble and all his glory. I kind of wish um you know they'll make hopefully they'll make a frenzy because that's an easy recolor. I'm sure they'll do that. I don't know for sure, but um, if they do laser beak, that'd be pretty cool. You know, cool as well. But there you go. That is Rumble. All right, so there he is next to Magic Square Mirage. Then you got New Age Prime and Megatron and Mirage. And you got the Bumblebee as well. Uh, you got Core Class uh, Optimus Prime. And you got Core Class Wheelie. And threw in uh, Dr. Woo Woo Woo, Cosmos and Ultra Magnus, and then Tis McGee Redgar. Scale. And then Crappy Gunners, Crappy Tool Paper, Triple A Battery, Car Mix, Care Bears, Kicker, and Squeaks. More scale. Well, hey there, everybody. If you made this far, I appreciate that. All right, final thoughts on this is Studio Series Concept Art Decepticon Rumble Frenzy, whichever you want to come from. He's from the Bumblebee movie. And um, overall, he's fine. You know, not one of my favorite core classes, but you know, the only thing, I don't, I, he don't have any hands. That would be cool if they would give him hands uh, to, you know, actually hold the weapons. But that would be pretty, pretty cool. Uh, he does have the 5-2 Toys cube mode. Um, like that, that they, he actually fits in Soundwave. That's pretty cool. wish I had Soundwave to put him in there, but... You know, like I said, there's several pictures and several videos out there of him fitting in there, so that's pretty cool. Uh, I'm sure they'll make a frenzy, whichever one, you know, and uh, hopefully they might do a laser beak as well. That'd be pretty sweet. Uh, the paint, you know, overall is really good. I like the light blue, the red, the, you know, the gunmetal silver, some yellow. They're really good on the paint. Like I said, uh, Studio Series, use, or the Core Class Studio Series usually do, does a pretty good job with that. Articulation, you know, it's fine. <laughs> he's got he's got ab crunch and everything. He can do some a couple poses, not much. Um, just a fun little desk bot, you know, to mess around with. Um, I found this at Target. You know, I didn't really order. I didn't order him online, uh, but I did come across him at Target. And he's like 12 bucks. I was like, eh, why not? I love some Transformers. So, yeah, but overall, he's okay. You know, he's just, you know, he's there. You know, he's just, just rumble and all that stuff. So, yeah. So, I uh, hope you like my review. Hit me up some likes, shares, prayers, and care bears. Hit that sub button for me if you don't mind. And hit me up some comments. Tell me you thought of the review. You got this guy. What do you think of him? And uh, follow me on my Discord, uh, Instagram, and TikTok. I just follow. I just uh, passed 500 uh, followers on TikTok, so it'll be pretty cool if you follow me over there. And uh, yeah, go watch my reviews. You know, it'd be pretty cool if you did that as well. So I guess I'll see you on the next Transformer review. And as always, be good to yourself, man. Help freaking Transformers and help freaking Frenzy Rumble. And good night, folks. Well, let's do some pile driving. You know, make shake things up a little bit. Hey, what's up, man? Hey, what's up, man? Everybody, how y'all doing? Oh, what's up, Rumble? Frenzy? Which one are you this today? Ah, oh, they call me Rumble, so I'll just be Rumble today. Okay. Man, what's up, man? Hey, what's up, uh, baby? How you doing? I'm pretty good. Man, y'all want to shake and tumble? Yeah. That's my firehouse. Y'all know that? Shake and tumble. Oh, I'm shaking. Look at me shake. Uh, look at me shake. Uh, shake. <laughs> All right. All right. Good night, folks. Floor time. You got to love it.